When you think of workers' compensation, you usually think maybe falling on the job, breaking a bone, but along with injuries, workers' comp also covers illness. And of the hundred of workers' comp claims made in the state relating to COVID-19, roughly 83% of them have been made by our frontline workers. Numbers from Washington's Labor and Industries Department show that of the 806 COVID-19 related claims, 673 were from those on the front lines, 636 from healthcare workers, 37 from first responders. The people behind these numbers range from police officers and nurses to janitorial staff. I'm not surprised that the majority of COVID-19 workers' compensation claims are coming from healthcare workers. That's Marissa Baker, assistant professor of the UW School of Public Health. She is an expert in looking at data like this and says, well, this is a start. These numbers aren't the entire picture. So it's great to see these data, but it's also important to remember that um, not everyone is counted and the true burden is likely higher. Workers' comp data is reliant on people submitting claims. To get the true burden, we'd have to look at the Department of Health's data. DOH spokesperson Will Finn said that they're not giving that out yet because their numbers aren't complete, therefore not reliable. Understanding um, kind of just the burden of exposure in a workplace, I think is powerful for policy setting. What the numbers from Ellen I do, however, is give us a look at who is impacted. That not only can influence state policy, but figure out how hospitals, nursing homes, and ambulances can create a safer environment by seeing who's getting sick. If it's, you know, a physician or someone working with the patient, there might need to be some increased PPE. Um, if, um, if it's a janitor, you might need to think about how to um, turn over the rooms in a different way. Something Marissa pointed out to me, if you're an essential worker, you're around a lot of people on the job, and then you are diagnosed with COVID-19, fill out an LNI workers comp claim. You go to the doctor to do so, and if it's accepted, you could have all your medical bills taken care of. In Seattle, Vanessa Bashania, King 5 News.